Your Highness, may her name belong. Thank you. I found this woman and her daughter with this baby at Ogumagana Forest while I was hunting. They claim to be displaced from some part of the north and that they have been wandering in the forest for the past 17 days. Hmm. And uh, she told you that this is her daughter? Yes, Your Highness, normally picky. You look too young to be the mother of this. Mm. And what about the baby? No, my picking too. I see. Mm. Thank you very much for bringing them here. Mm. Um, my queen. Yes, my king. Go and find them some very comfortable accommodation. Consider it done, my king. Find them something to eat. Mm. Consider it done, my king. The royal guest house. You have to wait a moment for the maids to clean up the room. Yes, yes, my queen. I thank you very much, ma. She is the queen of Abulano Autonomous Community. Address her as Your Highness. Thank you very much, you very much Your, Your Highness. Highness. You're welcome to our land. <laughs> Your comfort is indeed in our hearts. You're welcome. Your Highness, I shall go home now to wash up. The maids will soon be done. Thank you very much, sir. You're Thank welcome. you very much, sir. You are indeed caring. You're welcome. Your Highness, this is exactly what the gods have been waiting for. Mm, I suppose you mean that that's what the gods have been preparing us for. <laughs> I have given them some very good accommodation and I think they're enjoying it. <laughs> <laughs> it is really good news, Your Highness. <laughs> um, <laughs> finally, the gift of the gods is eventually manifesting. <laughs> Your Highness, this calls for celebration in our land! Mm. <laughs> Your Highness, mm. I have to keep my fingers crossed until the gods finally confirms her to be their choice. <laughs> Your 
Your Highness. Mm -hmm. My fellow elders. Do we need a mirror to look at that which is in our palms? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it is clear that our ancestors sent those strangers so that we can meet in the minds of the gods. Mm. <laughs> what you have said is true. Um, you see, when a child rushes in and tells you that he has caught an eagle, uh, don't be in a hurry to clap for him or endorse that claim. You see, because sometimes uh, when children look at vultures, they appear like eagles to them. <laughs> so, <laughs> what I am suggesting is um, we wait. Yes, we must hear from the gods. They will tell us whether this girl is their choice. Then we can proceed from there. <laughs> Thank you, Chief Priest. Mm. Your Highness, the girl is the perfect choice of the gods. Mm. May the gods be praised. Mm. It is now left to you to do what needs to be done. I shall fulfill my responsibility to the gods and my people. Mm. I have spoken as it pleases the gods. The rest is left to you. It shall be done as the gods demand. As a gossip. My sister, this thing has nothing to do with gossip. Ah, okay, is it a male or a female? A female, of course. A young girl I had. In that case, the demand of the gods have come to pass. Mm -hmm. My sister, the gods can never lie. I am happy for our land, though. Mm -hmm. Me too. I was afraid that a time like this will never come. And the dangers it may cause to this community. Ah, may the gods be praised. May the gods be praised, my sister. May the gods be praised. Let us go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to be here. <laughs>
Greetings. Please accept this gift from me. You are a blessing to our land. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. You are welcome. Greetings. Take this gift from me. You are blessed to our land. Thank you. Thank you. I send for you. I desire to compensate you for your role in ensuring the fulfillment of the program of the gods for our people. Take this envelope. The money inside is all yours. Your Highness, may you live long. But I'm not worthy to collect cash reward from you for something that is of good to our land community. Besides your highness, I am also a beneficiary to the blessing that will come from. That's very thoughtful of you and um, I am proud of you as the son of this community. But you see, nobody ever turns down a gift from the king. Take that money. It's yours. Thank you. Now you will swear by that money that you now have that you must not reveal the plan of this community for those strangers in our midst. I swear by this money, Your Highness, that never will I divulge the secret plan of our community. Neither to it one. Good. I'm proud of you. May the gods lead you. You can go now. Take them every seven hours, okay? It's all right. Thank you. How much? No, you don't have to pay. Why? That's instruction from the king. Haba, but it's the king that gave me money to buy whatever I want to buy. Well, um, he ordered us not to collect money from you or from any members each time we give you services. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Thank you. So, excuse me, what's the name, please? My name is Itoa. Itoa. It's okay. Thank you. Why? Take me. 
Why is everybody refusing to collect money from me when I buy things from their shop? Ha! <laughs> it's uh, Is that why you're scared? Me, yeah, I'm really scared though. They said the king instructed them not to collect money from me when I get something from their shop. Are we forbidden in the village? Oh, it's uh, Not at all. Not at all. See. No one is forbidding you or your mother. Hmm? See, um, it is our culture in this village to treat our strangers that way, especially when they mean well. So you don't have to be scared. Hmm? Okay. But why did the king have to bring a medicine doctor to check I and my mother? Me too, huh? The king actually brought the medicine man to confirm if you and your mom mean well for this land. Abla no community loves you and your mom so much. Hmm? So you don't be scared. Okay. Yes. Uncle Akuba will be on my way now. Go away. items I got for free today, courtesy of your highness. Uh, well, thank you very much, but it's customary for our people to welcome strangers by offering them everything free of charge. So you don't have to thank me specially. This young man here is a medical doctor. I've engaged him to give attention to your mother. Hmm? you Allah, thank you very much your highness how much can we pay you back for all your generosity don't worry don't attempt to pay me for anything let's make sure your mother gets well first so take him to go and see your mother
but it's good for you. And once again, you are welcome to our land. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Good We are happy to see you in our land. Thank you. 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 Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Claim our coming is a blessing to their land. Blessing? Yes, Mama. <sighs> this is their goodness to us. It's not pure. This is not pure. I think they are doing all this because of your condition. Condition? Yes. Yeah. 
Yes. You just get as it is they do me inside, like. We're supposed to find out something. Eh? I've already done that. Eh? Yes. Akuba said it's the tradition of the land to show love to any stranger who mean well for the land. My husband is troubled. Yes, you're right, my queen. My heart is troubled. And whenever the problem of Abelano appears to be attracting some solution, some ugly development reacts and now this, this innocent child, this innocent child. But my king, you don't have to consider her innocence. The will of the court must be done. Listen, my conscience is troubled. That's my problem. Conscience has nothing to do with this, my king. Think about the consequences if you give in to that soft side of your heart. I know there will be consequences, no doubt. I also know that the gods have decreed and because of that I have no choice. Alright, the decree of the gods must be executed. Thank you for reminding me of that. Will you reign long, your highness? Thank you. If we still have some bush meat, get me a little quantity, it helps me to think. Forgive you for what you do me. I find it very hard to forgive you. Mama. Mama, please find a place in your heart to forgive me, Mama. Mama, I beg you. Mama, please. 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 Mama, I beg you, you can't let me come up for this land, eh? Can you let me come up for this land? Mama, but they have been nice to us. And that their niceness, now they fear me pass. That their niceness, just they fear me. They beg you, can't let me come up for this land, eh? Can you let me come up for this village? Mama, take you to where? Take you to where? Take you to a place where they will be wicked or not, so take you to where? Take it to, to a place where we we'll pay for everything we buy. Mama, these people have been nice to us. You should be thankful to God. This land is just like a blessing to us, Mama. 
How bad? Is that why you broke the plate? You threw off the food I gave to you. Give me a bed, a bed. Come on, come on, come on. It's not good, though. Mama, this is not come on for here. Take this money and buy whatever you like with it. Thank you, Your Highness. But I don't think I have a need for it. What do you mean by that? You are taking care of most of our needs. Yes, I... Uh, I agree that I have taken care of most of your needs. Yes, Uh-huh. But... Not all of them. Yes, Your Highness. But I'll work very hard to achieve the other one myself. Which one is that? Your Highness, I want to go to school to achieve my dreams. Mm. You want to go to school? Yes, Your Highness. Your Highness, why is cool? That is not what she's meant for. Mm. Mm. 
Your Highness. I think she should serve the purpose for which the gods brought her. May you live long, Your Majesty. I think we shouldn't even consider it. Not after waiting this long for her. Your Highness, in my own opinion, she should serve her purpose. That's my humble opinion. Not after waiting this long for her. I thank all of you for your contributions. Um, you know, sometimes a butcher has to fatten his cow before killing it. I know that this situation calls for caution and um, I, 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 I will think about it. I think about it. <laughs> your Highness. It is a risk to fatten this cow in question because it may outweigh its purpose. <coughs> your Highness, I am beginning to sense pity in your heart. That would be dangerous for the royal throne. The gods are wise, Your Highness. Um, I thank all of you for your advice. I will think about what you have all said and um, I'll handle it my own way. As, he, as, as your Highness. As your Highness. Please. I thank all of you. Good day, Your Highness. I am Mrs. Oka, the principal of Community Secondary School. Is that from your highness? Yes, I did. I want you to register her in your school. Okay, your highness. Thank you very much, your highness. Thank you. You can join her. Thank you very much, your highness. Thank you so much. How you doing, huh? yes. I am offering you an opportunity to acquire the education you so badly desire. Yes, yes. You must concentrate on your studies. Now remember, to whom much is given, more is expected. You can go now. That's all I crave for, and you know that. Which kind of yeah, yeah, education you they talk about? The same education. We, 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 we nearly kill us for naught. My picking. I don't tell you before. Education no good for any woman when get sense. Mama, that's a lie. It's not true. And how many times you won't die? Now, now how many times you won't could die for that your dream before you go wake up? Mama. My dreams can only be empty without proper education. And I don't tell you many, many times. Eh? You don't need education to take five husband. You don't need education to take learn how to cook good, good food. You don't need education to take carry belay. Eh? Mama, see. 
the kitchen, the labor room, they are all part of my existence. I know that. Mama, that's the only thing that will make me human. Like the men. Yes. Mama, see, what's good for the men is better for the women. Nami born you. Eh? Nami born you. And Nami go decide what you go do. Nobody you go decide for me. Mama. 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 Mm. It's education or nothing. Itoha! Itoha, come back here! You speaking at the year word. Which kind of picking be this one? Hey. Okay. Your Highness, you shouldn't have sent her to school. Mm, well, I don't know why you think so, but um, a good farmer would first of all till the soil, fertilize the soil before proceeding to plant. That way, he gets bigger yields. I don't mean to doubt your wisdom, my friends. But we have waited for so long for a child that we call to accept. I think we can wait a little longer. Um, popular thinking might just go along with your own impression, but let me have things my own way for a change and begin. May the gods bless your way, my king. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much, my queen. Um, I I would like to be left alone for now, so if you'll excuse me, let me do some thinking on my own. Okay, my king. Using the below example to answer the following question is still the, the same solving we use. But I just said in that solving that you approximate it. Yeah, now that's why they said you should use the following example. So okay, 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 okay. Yes, let's write it down. Yeah, so we follow by this, he will approximate the the B yes to get what we want right yeah they will plus it by seven times thirty five yeah times seven okay times thirty five okay seven times thirty five over hundred oh mother and so the mathematics home work it is greetings your highness greetings how are you I'm fine thank you your highness there yes mother Please come, let me show you something. Okay. It's her. Please, she will be with you in a moment. She can't be your friend. Why, mother?
三点。So、what do you want? I've come to see the king. Come to see the king? Yes. What for? Please, please. It's very important. I had a terrible nightmare concerning the strangers. Please. I just need to see the king. A please. terrible nightmare, you see? Yes. It's a meeting that happens in the night. So, let's go. You can't see the king based on that. Please. Please, I need to see the king. I said, go home! Please. I need to see the king. Get out. Please. It's very urgent. Please, let me see him. Madam, please! Yourself a dreamer. <laughs> Class, education is a vehicle that carries you to your choosing destination. But it must be driven by you for you to need education. First, you must have a destination. And what is that destination? Destination is a choosing career. Which is what you will be in future. I mean, what you children will be in future. Now, tell me, how many of you here already have a dream career? Yes, it will happen. Let us know your dream career. Thank you very much, Ma. Ma, I want to become a renowned professor of law. Clap! Clap for her! So, tell us, why do you choose to be a professor of law? I want to become a professor of law. So I can institute laws and protect the rights of the girl child. And why are you particular about girl child education? The girl child education is long treated with a very low importance. The girl child is subjected to small or no dream, but I believe she will perform better than the cultural limitation placed on her, especially by our native African tradition. Class, put your hands together for Alright, Chief Priest, cut out all that incantation and tell me why you're here. Mm. The gods have lost patience with you, my highness. Well, the gods should know that I'm close to executing their orders. It is only the minds of the gods that I have just spoken to you. I know. I am not one to shirk my responsibility. That's not part of my weakness. If I say I am close to executing the orders of the gods, I mean exactly what I have said. I know what my responsibilities are, and I will not relent in carrying them out. Then, May the gods of our ancestors be with you. Go in peace. Hmm. Uh, 
So how are you? I did fine. I brought you this bush meat. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah. I should be on my way now. Hmm? Um, Ifuba. Hey. I feel I just be wrong for my mind. Mm. But why? The kind of dream when I dreamed last night about the good things when your people they do. They fear me. <laughs> See, uh, Mami Toa, that should not bother you. Hmm? You see, our people love strangers a lot. Treat them like semi god. In fact, it was transferred to us from our forefathers. Mm. Huh? Mm. You don't finish. That is all for now. But if you still want to hear more, just wait for another seven days. Seven days? <laughs> what did they happen for seven uh, days? Mami Toa, mm? enjoy your meat. Seven days. It's it's over. Why did you say all that about girls today? Daya, it's a long, painful story, my dear. A painful story, you say? Yes. My father came from a tribe where the girl child is treated as a modern slave. What? You're forced to marry when you're not ready. You're denied education and you refer to as a baby manufacturing machine. Look, my mother gave birth to me when she was 13. Yes. And my father betrothed me to a wealthy man when I was two years old. And when my father died, he came to take me as his wife, but I refused. That's the cause of I and my mother's problem today. I'm very sorry. Is that why your mother's leg was amputated? Yes. This is a really painful story. That's one of the consequences of disobeying the tradition of my tribe. Although she did not support my decision. So I'm very sorry, okay? All the, all the fine. All is gone. So once more, I welcome all of you. Yeah. Greetings, Your Highness. I've gone to Ojaji's house as instructed, but it's not feeling fine, Your Highness. Don't It's alright, let's go back here. It covers faster. We can go now. So I tell you why I assembled all of you. I made up my mind to do as the gods commanded. <laughs> Your Highness. Thank you for your decision. We rejoice with you and the entire people of Abulano village. Hmm. 
Igwe. Your Highness, I think there is something that we need to do before moving on. Um, if I may suggest, Igwe, uh, let us confirm that that girl is not the true mother of that baby. Uh, that is my humble suggestion, Your Highness. <clears throat> Your Highness, that is exactly the same question that is running through my mind. Whenever I see that girl, This is a very fine observation. I do have hard to think about this thing quite honestly because that is one thing that must disqualify her. If she is the mother of that baby, she disqualified because if she's not a virgin, then she has no business being the church of the gods. And I shall proceed to confirm that. that you are the mother of that baby. Why didn't you open up to us so that we can take good care of you? Your Highness, that information is wrong. How would I have given birth at my age? <laughs> it's okay, I understand. Maybe you're feeling shy to open up. But don't worry, okay? Your secret is safe with me. Tell me, who is the father of that child? Your Highness, he's my younger brother. Come, come close. Our father is Leeds. And whoever might have given you that information is wrong. My mother gave birth to him six months before her accident. Okay, Ito. I believe you. But do not hesitate to share your deepest secret with me. You can count on me. Did you get it? Yes, Your Majesty. Thank you. It's okay. So how is your mother? She's fine. You're taking care of her? Yes. It's okay. Emergency. Oh, where is Itoa? It is very urgent. You didn't fear me. Talk to me. What did happen? Where is Itoa? What did happen now? Okay, she come out. Don't worry. Don't bother anymore. I must find Itoa. Oh, oh now you didn't fear me. What did happen? What did happen now?
from now on, anybody that asks you about your little baby brother, tell the person that he is your son. Ah. Do you hear me? Why? I keep saying yes. Yes, yes, and nothing but yes. Boy, he's my brother. Just do as I have said. I overheard the discussion in the diary on your way back from school. I believe in your dream. Akuba, I don't understand what you are saying. I don't understand it's you. It's alright. The only way you understand what I'm saying is to just do what I have said. Keep saying yes. Akuba, the queen interrogated me earlier and I told her the truth. So I don't understand what you are saying now. You did? Yes. Hey! Aru Eme. Uh, what happened now? Akuba. Akuba, talk to me now. What's happening? Akuba, what's happening now? Akuba. It is not something you should cry about. It is the will of the gods, and it must be done. Your Highness, that one big. This one big past me will lie. Look, it, it will be a blessing to this community. It will make you a very happy person forever. Look at this entire royal household. This is where you will belong and will be taking care of you for the rest of your life. Can't you understand? You can do this. Now because of this same matter, I nearly died. Because of this same matter, I made that this condition when I did. Because of this same matter, I made me and my children run come up for not and die in the bush. <laughs> it's okay. Please. There is no doubt that God brought you here for this same purpose. Like the king has said, you will be greatly appreciated. You will be well taken care of. Stop crying, okay? Why you Anana? <laughs> Why are you Anana? <laughs> Greetings, Your Highness.
Mama. Me a paro. Weep no more, Itoha, for you have only found favor in the eyes of the gods. If the gods want to favor me, then they should allow me to live my dreams. Mm. The gods have already helped your dreams to come true. For it's a tradition in Abulan no kingdom that the king shall have a male child before he sits on the throne for 20 years. Our present king has ruled the land for 19 years now. He has taken five wives, but none, none of them have given him a son. None has given him a son. Mm. It is for this reason that the great oracle of our land, the great Arusiana, has predicted that for the king to have a son, he must marry a virgin from another tribe who must be below the age of 18. You have been chosen. It is your destiny to become the saving queen of Abolano Kingdom. <laughs> and, and I congratulate you, your highness. It's too late for this unholy choice of a god. It's too late. I have chosen the path to go. My education remains my husband till I achieve my dreams. A new man, born of a woman, can make me change my direction impossible. Mm. Do you know what it means for you to be the mother of a queen? The blessings and privileges that come with royalty. Do you know the respect, the dignity, the affluence you will have? Think of it. Your daughter will be parading with a king. You will have everything at your disposal and you will also belong to one of the decision makers in this Abolano. If you know what you gain in this Abolano village, I bet you, you will in a hurry embrace the blessing that is coming from the gods. Your Highness, I want it. I like it. After all, even day when I did so far. Eh? But there is problem. Eh? The problem now, my daughter. Eh? Is she? What you are into her mother. The honest is on you as the mother to give her hand in marriage. You will enjoy it. You will. I'm not against it. Eh? I'm not against it. After all, me said I married when I swore. Eh? My parents give me out for marriage when I swore. I support it. Yeah, uh, thank you very much for being with her. Mm -hmm. I will proceed with the marriage arrangements. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. 
Congratulations for accepting to be the mother of a queen. So I just have to. But you knew all this why. Are you hiding it from me? So I, I tried to save you, but it was too late. It's never too late. No. I know what I want. And I cannot be deceived to accept just anything. Listen to her. Our tradition forbids a woman from turning down the king's proposal. Fine. Fine. Then I'm leaving this village with my family immediately. I'm going. Listen, I cannot guarantee you such at the moment. It is only the king that has the power to take such decision. But let me warn you, you must be careful with whatever you are deciding. From this very moment, it all. Every little time you spent with me is not a risk to my life. Please, it all. I beg you. Separate from me. Go and convey her belongings to my chambers. The mandate of the gods must take precedence over the whims of men and must be executed to the letter. Go. May your tomb belong, your highness. Let's go. Thank you. Hey, they go now. Are they going to come? Come, 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 you hey, know what? My sister, what does a stranger know now? What does a stranger know? I thought you've heard now. But please, do not say it to me. My daughter, I have always tell you say marriage now be the pride of woman. You can't go, go get your legs saying a king now they come for you. Hmm? You, 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 know, you know say, you know do plenty things for us. Now, King, now be the solution to our problem. I they beg you. I they beg you with my life. Grief for the King now. Your Highness, I am so happy for you. You should be the most proud woman of our land, having been chosen by the gods. I mean, I know you're not expecting this at this time. But the gods, knows the best for you. <laughs> you know say I born you when I small. Like when I small like this. These people they don't do plenty, plenty good things for us. If God say now you be the person when go give king, man picking. Accept now with good mind. <laughs> Mama. Mama. Mama, Mama, one life we are leaving this village first thing tomorrow morning. Perhaps that will change the choice of the gods. You must not do such a thing, Itoa. You must have to be very careful before you land yourself into a serious big trouble. The gods of our land is no respecter of any person. What's the problem?
My elder, why did you bring me here? Uh, look at the expanse of this land. It is all yours. Listen, the king will provide the people that will work for you. The king will also give you guards and men that will always be with you. Listen to me. Power and wealth will be in your hand like a dining spoon. And your entire life will be garnished with everlasting royalty. All you need to do is to say yes to the king's proposal. And every blessing, in fact, all these blessings become yours. That's all. My elder, all these things you just showed me and the promises the king made to me just added to the beauty of life. My elder, the most beautiful thing in life is the fulfillment of one's dream. I came from a part of the world where the girl child is trained not to have a dream of her own. Our culture and tradition and the flashy society have cornered the girl child to the receiving end of every societal disaster. I, Itoa, have vowed to make a change with my story. And sorry, my elder, I cannot repeat the mistake of my mother. The king has treated you with a kid glove enough. His tolerance is fast vanishing. Listen, you must help yourself enough as soon as possible from his wrath. I have delivered the message from the king. This is what every woman pays for. Actually, it is very, very rare for the gods to choose a wife, a king. But when they do, it brings great joy to the chosen. She is not only respected as the queen, but also as one chosen by Arusiana to bring great joy and happiness to the people of Abulano land. <laughs> yes, your highness. And you will become the greatest of all king's wife. And the present queen will leave the palace for you and relocate to royal chamber. Now you'll be in full control of all the powers that govern the land. What else is greater than this, your highness? My vision, my mission, my destiny, my aspirations. They are much more greater than all this which you just mentioned. Look, I want to be a queen of my destiny. Not a queen, under a king, no. The greatest thing I need now is a proper education. My elders, and I can't succumb to anything less. But the king has given you education, yes. Then let's end it at that. I cannot compromise my education for anything. <clears throat> um, Your Highness, um, like who was saying? Um, Good night, my elders. Hello, class. Hello, ma'am. Our last lesson we learned the citizenship and the fundamental human rights. Who can explain the meaning of citizenship? Nobody? Yes. Ma, citizenship can be defined 
as the ability to exercise the rights and privilege that come with being a member of a particular country. Give her a clap. <laughs> now today lesson, we have fundamental human rights. And this fundamental human rights, we are going to trade child rights. Now from our previous knowledge, who can tell us the meaning of child's rights? A child is anyone who is 18 or below. The UN General Meeting on 20th November 1989 adopted the National Union Convention of the Rights of a Child and the AU adopted the rights of a welfare in 1990. The 1990s were proclaimed Decade of the African Child by OAU. And the Day of the African Child was set aside on 16th of June every year. Thank you, Ma. Clap for her. Things and leave the class. The admission has been terminated now. I said, Pick your things and leave your mama and me. Mama. No. The king instructed that she picks nothing. Therefore, leave. I don't. Leave the class. I don't understand. I don't. I want to achieve my dreams here. Move! Please, Ma. Stand up and walk out! safety of my palace. 
which means you are one person she is used to. In other words, you have become some kind of confidant to her. Whatever you tell her, she's likely to believe because she's used to you. I have invited you here so I can exploit your attachment to her. I want you to go to her. Convince her of the need to get married to the king. Tell her it is the will of the gods, and by doing that she'll be fulfilling her own destiny. Tell her that. I shall do as the king has commanded. Your Highness, I shall be on my way now. Your Highness, I will seek for a little time. You know she's only about a child. To my queen as a child? Uh, pardon me, Your Highness. I was only trying to say that uh, she's a stranger and she's yet to adapt. That stranger has become my wife. She's my wife. It's your duty to persuade her. Now go and do as you're told. I will, my king. For our nose. Hmm? Baba, Mama. This is a counterfeit blessing. Mama, not every open door is a blessing. Mother, I know what I want. And if I can't achieve it, don't be order me to, to impact what I want. Mama, Itoha. Who means blessing? Hmm? Who means dignity? Who means all the better, better, better things? Eh? Mama, not the kind of queen I want to be. Mama, no. Mama, I want to be a professor of law. To defend the girl child. Mama, it's well defined. Mama, I stand for what I stand for. And I can't compromise it for anything. No, not at all. Professor, bow to the Queen, Your Highness. Ojoto, Ojoto. Ojoto, Ojoto. Give me the overnight now. Nah, what are you waiting for? Ah, uh, I've told you several that I'm saving my pan wine for the ego ceremony that is coming up. Which marriage? Uh, the ego marriage, of course. <laughs> Ojoto, you better say your pan wine. Unless you want your pan wine to spoil. And invested with maggots. Hmm? Now, your guys, this pan wine is made for Igwe marriage alone. If you want beer, I have beer. I have beer. Ojoto, I need overnight, Ojoto. That's an Igwe ceremony. Igwe's marriage. Oh, Ojoto, I bring the beer now. Mm. Mm. Let me just manage it. How are you looking now? But do not say I did not warn you, Ojoto. Mwabe, <coughs> Mwabe. Yeah, thank you. Let me just manage mm -hmm. here. Then. When you get to the Igwe marriage, in Mwaze Pawan. No problem. Let me just manage here. Hmm? Hey. Your Highness, I don't want you to face the wrath of the chief priest. Marry the king and let peace reign. 
There's only one definition of peace for me, and that's fulfillment. I must fulfill my glorious destiny, and it starts for my education. Your Highness, if you marry the king, you will have money, fame, farms, lands, clothes, and every other good thing that comes with education. It will be a taboo for you to turn down the king's proposal. If you marry the king, you can still go back to school. There you'll be more respected as the queen of Abulano community. The king loves you and he means well for you. Even the gods who have chosen you equally means well for you. Your Highness, you know where you are coming from. And this will be a breakthrough for you and your family. Linus, the gods are wise. Please, Your Highness, think about it. Your Highness, please marry the king. have to pass through these tribulations to attend the prestigious positions. <laughs> Do you all have to fight for your dreams at every point of life? Why is woman world so full of limitations? Why can't a woman have the rights to choose what they become in the future? Come pay your bride price. By this time tomorrow, my Pekin will become the queen of Abulanu land. <laughs> Mama, by this time in the nearest future, you thought I would be a professor of law. I know. King, say. He go put you for school after the marriage. <laughs> Mama, you should have cared to know if that's what I want. Mama, education and marriage are two different things. We must have to do one before the other, Mama. <laughs> Don't start that thing when you do for not. Oh. Don't be that one when um, Aladdin nearly killed me. Now we don't call here now. You won't call Rick's my own life, ba? You know go work. Whether you like him or you don't like him, you can marry him tomorrow. I don't talk my own feelings. <laughs> Go ahead, sir. The people of Apulano, I bring you message from the Royal Majesty, King Baru Marunga, and the Honorable Council of Elders. The marriage between the king and Itoha shall be held tomorrow at the palace. As tradition demands, the bread price will be paid behind closed door between the elders and our queen mother to be. Everybody is expected to 
to greet the new queen at the palace. Oh yeah, no, call it you. Congratulations, Your Highness. Am I the sweet me well well? Eh? Finally, I go become mama of queen. No cry, yeah. I don't say this your tears, not tears of joy. Eh? I go greet you again. Congratulations, Your Highness. Abulana land is pleased to have you, your highness. Look, maiden, get the animal skin. Let her place her leg on it. Yes, ma'am. The hair, the hair, please try and comb it very well. Make her look beautiful, like she is. with our marriage entitlements. That will be fine. At least that makes her your wife by tradition. Okay. I wish to remind you of our earlier arrangement before I supported this marriage. The arrangement still stands. I mean, the moment she gives me my son, I will execute the arrangement. That is not the arrangement, my king. The arrangement is immediately you get married to her. I have spoken. And I am the king. Straight to the yeah, yeah, exactly. Uh, permit me to stand up and uh, address there. No, 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 no. <laughs> you know uh, I greet you once again, uh, mother of our queen to be. <laughs> yes, His Royal Highness, the Eagle of Abulano Kingdom, has sent us with part of the marriage entitlements. And uh, these are the things we have brought here, so that uh, the move can begin for the marriage. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, that is the message. Yeah. Uh, yeah. If there's anything I am missing, please remind me. Not. Oh uh, no, you are uh, on point. I'm on point. Yes. Yeah, yeah, More will still come. Part of it. This is part of it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, now thank you very well, Thank you. My 
Am I sweet me where where? As an attack come, bring all these things. Eh? Who I help me thank the king go? Eh? He do well. Tell and say, I accept her. The message sent to the smoke must get to heaven. I assure you. Eh? Eh? There's one other thing. Okay. We need to take a message back to our king. Uh, so I know that uh, our queen to be is in there. <laughs> can we use him on her so hey, that we can all appreciate her? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Eat all her. <laughs> oh yeah. Eat all her, my fine Pekin. Eat all her, fine girl. Come, come, come. Your husband said, "Don't come." Eat her! She's got a wine. I'm a I'm a I'm a queen. I'm a queen. I'm This is a queen befitting for our king. Befitting for Yes. Why do you want to force a little girl into marriage when all she desires is to go to school and fulfill her dreams? <laughs> Let me tell you all, Itoha can never, never marry my father. <laughs> Otherwise, find her if you can. Please, you have to leave immediately. Any moment you stay here is a threat to my life. I have told you before, please leave. Please Ito, go. Go, you put me in trouble. Go. Please now. Please. Please now. Please, please, please. Show me. Ito, go. Please leave. You put me in trouble. Ito, go. What are you doing here? You should be getting married today ahead. Mrs. Atu, you alone taught me how to pursue my dreams and aspirations. And you alone also know why I don't want to get married to the king. I can't find my way out. Please help me. What you ask of me is dangerous. If anyone finds you and I here, then I'm doomed. You're my teacher. You taught me how to pursue my dreams. And you say we should make every possible sacrifice to pursue it. Please help me out. It's okay. It's okay. You see, I will only show you the way out. That's all I can do for you. Okay? Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you, ma'am. You are nearly right. You are nearly right, but nearly cannot kill a bird. Even one zap. It's the best thing in the world. Don't insult me. Don't insult me. Mubam Maya. Ojoto. Ojoto. Ojoto, can I know the other madam? My wife. Ojoto, come and give me drink before I transfer my aggression to you now. Ojoto! Ah ah! Do you know why or not? Do you know why? Ah I'm bringing it, can't you see it? Look at this one though. He's even expressing anger. Was I the one who told you to reserve your drinks for the Ugo's marriage? Oh! A marriage that was only but a sham. A sham? You know what Igwe did not consult with me. Every man they be going and not. I lived 30 years in Boronu, 15 years in Adamawa, 
15 years in uh, Kenkan above uh, Gombe. 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 Oh, Gombe. Gombe. Let me tell you, you lie. Igwe allowed them to flog him 50 strokes of Ken. Hmm. Don't listen. Igwe, Igwe, Igwe was there like a baby. And, it, and that's the only reason that the not, marriage is not going to be a marriage. Make sure you know. Make sure you know. Know. Say what you know. I can see that what the thing you are taking is 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 affecting your medulla abukata. Don't insult me. That is the main reason the marriage was cancelled. I said keep quiet. Mbaka. Mbaka. Adolto. Lebe Maya. Iboya. Iboya Lebe Maya. 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 Maya. Lebe Maya. Lebe Maya. Lebe Maya. Lebe Maya. Lebe Maya. Lebe Maya. Insisting on going to school. Why not promise her that you will send her back to school after her fourth child? Yeah, because the son could be the one your highness is seeking. <clears throat> well, I have told her all that, but uh, I have not managed to convince her. This is a huge problem of all the strangers in this village. She is the one chosen by the gods. And uh, she is proving impossible. Well, I... I wouldn't say she's proven impossible. Um, uh, she's not used to our culture. I have paid her bride price. And if you pay somebody's bride price, she uh, automatically becomes your wife. So, no matter where she runs to, my guards will fetch her. She's my wife. <laughs> and uh, the person that the guards are destined to give me a son. <laughs> so, she will come back. Will... Your Highness. Yes, she will come back. Your faith gives me much hope. The guards will help. I know that they will. So I forgot to ask you, what about your wife? How is she doing? For the last time, I asked you, where is she? I don't know her whereabouts. Believe me. Now listen. She couldn't have discussed her whereabouts with anyone but you, Akuba. If I may ask you, would you like to taste the rot of the king? How could you think that I would betray my land? My own Abulano community? I can't do such thing. Akuba! You have till sunset to provide her. Failure to do so, you answer to the king. Let's go. Ah, 
Education is a key for the reason. Buy us some food. My brother is too hungry. Okay, madam, please give her more food. Thank you very much, ma. Weep no more. The royal guards will surely find her wherever she is. You know, in three days, three days, I never see my daughter and my small Mickey. Who knows if they don't die? Hey. 
it's okay. <laughs> Nothing will happen to them, okay? She will be somewhere in this village. Not to worry, okay? Not to worry. The king has ordered and asked the whole village to join in the search. Oh. Itoa! Itoa! Itoa, why you do me this thing? Why you do me this thing? It's okay. Stop crying. Oh! It's okay. It's okay. Itoa! started from the notes. Before my dad died, he betrayed me to an Alahaji. And when my father finally died, the Alahaji came to marry me, but I refused. My mother wanted me to marry him so I can fend for my family. The Alahaji unleashed war on my mother claiming it's my mother that asked me not to marry him. So we were attacked. And my mother lost her leg in the process. That was how we ran away from the nuts. Now, the king of the village, Iranto, is also asking your hand in marriage. What a wicked word. I have always desired dedication since my childhood. I have always desired to be different from what the society wants the girl child to become. I have promised myself to become the agent of change. Please, ma, I know you can help me. All I need is education. I can serve you in your house. Don't give me money. Just send me to school. Give me food. Provide for me and my brother. Please, ma, I know you can do it. I beg you in the name of Allah. Please. I know you can do it for me and my brother. Please. I beg of you. Please. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you very much, ma. Welcome, Chief Priest. I sent for you. Mm. 
It has been four days since my supposed wife disappeared from the palace. We've searched everywhere for her. She's not been found. What do I do? But <laughs> your highness, the gods have given us the powers to help ourselves at times like this. I have searched every nook and cranny of this community. She is nowhere to be found. So, as a mother, what do I do? Then, <laughs> mix me, your highness. To jump her to be talk. Ordinarily, that should be your responsibility. I don't have to give you permission for that. Having said that, Chief Priest, I don't care how you return her to the palace. Just do me one thing. Bring her back to the mm. palace. Mm -hmm. you it is settled, Your Highness. Hello, Chief. Yeah, it's me, Madam Sugar. Yeah, I have exactly what you want. Perfect sex, perfect age, no stress. So, what is your offer? No, 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 Chief. No, 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 no. It can't be as usual. No, Chief, I know what it costs me to get this one from a very deep village in the north. No, I can't take that. Okay, I go for one million. Yes. You can pass delivering. Okay. It's a deal. Thank you. Yes, ma. Thank you very much. It's okay. I guess you need more. This would be a blessing, ma. Do here. Not to worry. Hmm? I'll make sure you go to one of the big schools in town to fulfill your dream. Okay? And I'll take good care of you, like my own child. Before you know it, you become a renowned professor of law and prove your mother wrong. But for now, you stay with me in my hotel till I return to my home in Lagos. better we stay here for as long as we can than taking such news to the king. I disagree with you on this one, Ogada. We've searched every nook and cranny of this kingdom. 
yet we couldn't find her. The best thing we do now is to go back to the king and give him the situation report. Akata, I take your right. For the heart of the king. It's better we go back on time and give him the report of our search. You should be the one to tell him that Saturday not me. But I am not leaving here if I don't get uh, Akuba. Or Doha. I'm not living here if I don't get a cover or you don't have. I've told you before now. Where are you going? Are you mad? I'm the chief guy. Come on, let's go. Why are you going before? I'm the chief guy. Come back here. Yeah, let's go. I'm going for you, so.
I want to believe it is well. Eh? Yes. It is. It is. Uh, I wonder why the eagle has summoned us to the palace. And that is why I am rushing to meet up. Oh. Huh? Maybe you want to see Carapina over the whole happening. Hmm. Listen, if I am to suggest, uh -huh. I'll advise the king to go to a faraway tribe huh? and pick another bride. Huh? Yes. There are many girls of Ituha's age out there who are willing to settle down with a man. Let alone a king. No. But the girls have chosen to do her now. Forget about that. Eh? See, listen. The gods can see she's proven impossible. Mm -hmm. And if the king does not get a new bride and impregnate her before the end of a month from now, I fear for his throne. To fear what? But the girls for me. That is why I am suggesting he goes to a faraway land. To pick another bride. Oh. May the gods forbid. May the gods forbid. To swap. Let's go. Let's May the gods forbid. We'll find out. Yeah. Let's go to the park and swap. Yeah. Madame Sugar, now Madame Sword. Hey, she, she stole my baby brother. I'm looking for my name is Madame Sugar. How do you accept we can give her enough for your money, Abi? I did not say him. I did not say him. He sent me on an errand. Though. Well, let me advise you. Next time, he said we can stay there for your money. I did not say my baby brother. Oh, you can go, Coro, amor. 
You know, you're a very attractive woman. How come you gave birth to such a rude girl? A girl that had the impudence, the audacity to run out of this palace, inconvenience me to the point where I sent all my guards to be searching for her. After all what I did for you and your daughter, I beg, make you no verse, eh? I won't give my picking to you for marriage. Eh? I beg, make you no verse. Guards! Your Highness, 
take her out. Your yeah, Highness, I beg now. My queen. I don't want to she see her here now. again. Beg your husband. Yes, folks. Your stay here is no longer needed. Go and perish in your own misery. You take her out. Move. My queen, mercy me now. Eh? Move. Your Highness, mercy me now. Eh? Your Highness, mercy me now. Eh? My queen. Move before you speak. Out. Move. Mercy me now. No, no, no. I bought all those things for her. She's going to leave this place as poor as she was before she came in. Get her, get out. Don't give her anything. Yes. Get out. Out. Take her out. 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 Get. Throw her out and lock that gate. Don't let her come in. Nonsense. Don't kill her. Me. 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 Nida first, you're a kidnapper. I know, I know, I know. Nida, Nida. But you pursue that girl. Why is she with you? See, let me tell you. That girl is from my village. She ran away. The king of my village sent me to the city to come and look for her. And immediately I saw her. She started running away and I was pushing her to come back. No, be honest, you tell that on a police, you will tell her. Liar! Liar! You want her to come back? You wanted to kidnap that girl. That's why she ran away. I'm not a kidnapper. I, 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 I believe you. I am a hunter. Believe me. Believe me. Not so see, because believe okay, me. Okay, see, see. If you are doubting me, eh? I will take you to my village. You can meet the king of my village and ask him. He will tell you that I'm a hunter. Village care. Me, me, go, go, go to village. Ta. Police. They go, 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 go police. Police. No, they go to police. No, they go police. Okay. Go on here. Stand up. We go police station. That's what they be. Stand up. You go. Okay, stand up. Let's go. You go to police station. Come on, pull us now. I don't believe you. That's why I'm not dying. You're a killer.
anyway, your highness, since the situation has turned out this way, may we know our next line of action. Yes, your highness. May we know. Because I'm worried. We are worried too. Hmm. Well, the way things are, we don't have a choice but to acquire another stranger as fast as possible. Your Highness, have the gods spoken concerning the situation? Your Highness. Uh, the chief priest is expected to be at this meeting. Because he is the voice of the gods, let's find out what he has learned from the gods. Your Highness, it is time that I am worried about. How soon can we get another stranger? Bring in another stranger. Get confirmation from the gods. And then uh, conduct the marriage. Tell me what the gods have said regarding our situation. Exactly. Your Highness, it is good that you asked. But then, first things first. Gods of Itoha must be retrieved as tradition demands and buried in Abulano soil because you already paid her bright price. Yes, she is your wife. Hmm. I tell you one thing, this thing the best me. Master, this thing the best me. Well, man, how can our Igwe, Igwe, buy a new car? Eh? You do not even test the car or drive it for once before the car gets an accident. Eh? Why? Mpoko. Mpoko, oh my kids, they go to our time. That's the way you talk at time that makes me think. If you don't, that, that you don't have something inside inside this call of yours. Is a drive? Did you go even enter the car? It's the reason of a drive. Did you go enter the car? Huh? Eh? Alika, this is wickedness. This girl is very, very, very wicked. Hey, Zoku, this girl is very mean. This girl does not even allow you go to touch her apple before one, before she die. What do you mean? Huh? Oh, hello. Boko. Aleka. You told her it's not there. Bet me. You told her it's not dead. Give it to me. You told her it's not dead. You told her only died. I can't say dead, dead, dead again. Now tell me. It all has just died. Die. This, 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 this dead smoke dead. no good for your head. This smoke, I swear, this smoke no good for your head. You know, it was the smoke weed. What do you mean? What do be the difference between die and dead? I'm not calling you hands, you're not calling you hands up. I'm not calling you hands up. I'm not calling you hands up. So you don't know that dead means past tense. You want to know? 
So you don't know that dead means past tense. That is present tense. And when I want is past participle. Yeah. It's a best school. Oh no, it's a best school. You know, sir, you know, sir, you know, sir, you know, sir. Now, 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 now. I know, I know, blame me. You know, I know, professor. Professor of this state. Professor of Undang. I didn't know you were going to do that. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. That is that. Professor, perfect. Professor. Nurse, my name is um, Pastor Joseph Ehiri. I am the General Overseer for Evangelical Missions, that's pressing forward Evangelical Missions. I, yesterday, I actually accidentally ran into a girl and I heard that she was brought to this hospital for medical attention. I ran to the police station to report myself because of jungle justice that is quite prevalent in this time in our country. So I just came to check how far she's recuperating. I'm so sorry, she didn't make it. No, 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 it's not possible. I'm talking about a young girl. I ran her, yes, but... She died immediately. She was rushed in here. God! How? I'm so sorry. She didn't make it. No, 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 no. That's not possible. I'm talking about a small girl. I know. She died immediately. She was rushed in here. No! She can't die. No, oh, Jesus! I'm so sorry. Jesus Christ. I just killed an innocent girl. Oh God. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Oh God, forgive See me. She ran away. In the same process, he went. She was knocked down by a hit and run driver. Mm. As I was trying to recover from the shock of what happened, this policeman here came and arrested me, claiming that I was trying to kidnap it to her. Igwe. We want to confirm whether this man actually knows the girl in question, Victor. Mm. She ran away from here, from this compound. And I instructed all my subjects to look for her and bring her back. And that's precisely what he was doing. He was obeying my instructions. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Hannes. Good. Yeah, no. So, any problems? Any further problems? No. Yes. Yes. Thank you, Steve. Can go now. Igwe. Uh, come, come, come. Johannes. This is the first time I'm witnessing a miracle of this man. Nurse, are you sure of what you are saying that Itoha is alive? Everything happened in my very presence. The pastor prayed and wept and the dead girl began to cough. Thanks to the God of our ancestors. Thanks to the God of our blood community. Then, where is she? And the pastor took her to a specialist hospital down the road. Where is the specialist hospital located? Mm. So just, if you just go Thank you very much. Yeah. <laughs> 
Education is a key for the reason.
Yeah. Your Highness, contrary to our belief that she died in the accident, she survived it. What? She survived? Yes. She survived? Where is she? She was rushed to the hospital. Which hospital? Which hospital? We were able to locate the hospital. Yes. How is she doing? How is she? How is she? Where is she? Um, um, Your Highness. Yes. When we got to the hospital. Yes. The nurse that was in charge of her. Yes. Said she went to the room where she was kept. Mm -hmm. And she was nowhere to be found. Your Highness. She disappeared. What did you say? She disappeared. She disappeared. Yes, yes. Now listen to me, you two. Go and find her wherever she is and bring her here. I don't want excuses at all. Your Highness. Yes, Your Highness. Now, Akuma, you listen to me. If you don't find that girl, you'll be sorry. Okay, you thought I was my picking. You thought I was going to give me my picking today. You thought I was going to give me my picking today. No, you thought I was going to give me my picking today. You thought I was going to give me my picking today. Mama, have mercy on me. You don't wear my bikini. My bikini, me. You don't wear my bikini. 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 Mama, I'm sorry. I don't wear my bikini. Mama, 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 is rare in this generation her character is worthy of emulation for a girl of her age to know her ambitions and her dreams is something remarkable I want to really thank you for nurturing her in a way that is very peculiar you know it is not just the responsibility of a mother to give the child food but also to throw the child in the right path Thank you. But Pastor, that is how my mama and my papa take bring me up. I marry when I date 12 years old. That is the reason why God has given you a child that is ready and determined to correct all the societal ills. Um, we are ready, the church and I, we are ready to take care of our education to any level yes pastor thank you very much thank God you pastor. bless you thank you thank you you deserve the best and for your mother we will set up a business for you business for me yes. 
Thank you very much, Pastor. Thank God will bless you. Kingship should come to my family. <laughs> See, it is tradition that if the Igwe does not have a son until after 20 years of his reign, the kingship will, will leave his family. Ah! Hey, Igwe. Hey! 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 Ah! Hey! 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 The, 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 the gods did not say that, 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 that you should marry any stranger. I fabricated that lie. Hey, 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 hey. I chose it all because, because I knew she would never agree to abandon her education and, and ambition. I am also the cause of Ito House accident. Congratulations, my queen. Congratulations. 